Hello friends, the other day I was watching the Jordan Peterson's interview with Bishop Barron and one thing really struck me from, uh, from the interview and it's why Jordan Peterson thought young people were leaving the church. And he said that young people were leaving the church because a, the grand adventure, the grand adventure of Christianity was really not put before them. Um, the church was not demanding enough from the young people. And I was thinking about this and what young people really desire. You know, young people look for authenticity, yes. They like people who are themselves. They like people who express their hearts and communicate um, what's going on in their in their hearts it's it's very true but also young people desire totality they don't like half-heartedness and in my life this is why me and my friends really looked up to kobe bryant growing up kobe bryant um, was a man who gave himself totally to his mission of being the best basketball player and and it required from him blood sweat and tears it demanded his entire life from his grueling workouts to all those playoff games to his excellence in the olympics kobe gave himself totally to his mission as a basketball player and if we christians gave ourselves totally to christ imagine how much more people we will attract and it's because you know the totality of the demands of Christianity is what makes Christianity attractive. And the demands, the striving to follow um, Christ and the ideals of Christianity is what makes Christianity so joy-filled and so fulfilling because it is precisely because it demands everything from us, not only morally, but spiritually, intellectually, bodily. It's a, a total handing over oneself on this grand adventure of following Christ. And this is why Pope St. John Paul II always said, open wide the doors to Christ, open wide the doors to Christ. You know, um, he will take nothing from you. Rather, he will fulfill every aspect of your existence and draw you to more fulfilling life in himself. So let us remember, you know, um, that we must, as Christians, give ourselves totally to Christ without holding anything back. And this is what it means to follow Jesus. Following Jesus, not half-heartedly, but wholeheartedly with um, our whole souls, our whole minds, our whole hearts in this adventure of love. God bless you all. Take care.